welcome to episode 75 and welcome to season four of our Family Travel Australia series. This week we kick off our lap around Australia with a beautiful stay in Kalani in Queensland's Southern Downs region. With its green rolling hills, spectacular views, rainforests and roaring waterfalls, this truly is a nature lover's paradise. Plus, we review another must-have camping product from Crazy Dog Canvas. Be sure to subscribe and join us for all of the adventure. <laughs> another awesome invention from Jason at Crazy Dog Canvas. Clever, simple, aren't they the best ideas? Again, just using the awning runner. We're gonna thread this through. Just go behind here like this. Just feed it on in. Da 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 dum da dee. Look at that. Isn't that absolutely brilliant? Now these are brand new on the market, so I'm sure there's plenty of ideas out there. You might have some ideas. Leave a comment below on what you would use this for. For us, we do pretty well all of our cooking outside. This will be perfect for all my weather stuff. There's always plenty of it, all the extra stuff that you gotta, you know, yell out. Hey, can you chuck me tongs? Oh, I didn't get a knife, I didn't get this, the paper towel. It'll all fit in here, which is great. Upstairs, we're gonna probably use for a lot of the outdoor lifestyle kind of stuff, a lot of, you know, beach stuff, stuff that you don't wanna bring bringing into the van. You could even just use it for shoes and things like that, you know, spare sunny sunscreen, etc. It will all fit there. It all breathes. A very cool part of this invention is the eyelets. So even if you didn't even have an awning runner, you can basically just Oki strap this off to anything, trees, to your car, back to another vehicle. Um, something very cool that we're doing is using an Oki strap from the floor anchor point from the, the awning kit and then just pulling that up through the eyelet there. And really that's just gonna stop it flapping around. You could even put a second one in, but I don't think there's much point. It, it will remove a trip hazard because there's already a line going there. So that's why that one works so well. Isn't that awesome? Awesome idea. All right, there you go. Crazy dog canvas. Love it. Good Jasper, good intro, and 12 months, the ultimate lap year has commenced. Oh, so awesome. So good. So exciting. We are doing our best to get around the entire country yeah. into every state and territory 
particularly those that we haven't explored yet. That's what I'm really excited about. Look, everyone keeps telling us the best is in the West. So that is high on my bucket list is mm. Western Australia. Well, I'm really excited about South Australia mm. as well, having never been there before. Yeah. Do you know, if we get the chance, touch wood, no COVID issues, we want to get back to Tassie as well. Yeah, for yeah, sure. We've just, got unfinished yeah, business exactly. with you, Tasmania. All that east coast that we're yet to explore. Mm -hmm. And then, of course, the Northern Territory, the Centre, Cape York. I mean, the list is long. So amazing. 12 months is not long enough. <laughs> <laughs> we already know that. Um, and we're certainly not going to rush it. We don't want to get into a situation where we're feeling stressed because we're, we're rushing. Yeah. I mean, look, 12 months to actually explore Australia is is an absolute gift it is so awesome we will try and bring you not only the popular places but the stuff that is the hidden gem the local knowledge mm -hmm. the real characters the culture of an area the stories the yeah, experiences not just you know here's another campsite we want to really make sure that we immerse ourselves in a place for a week and get in amongst it get to experiences and really bring you those the best of that that region Definitely. Exactly. Now listen, if you have somewhere that we absolutely yeah. have to put on our itinerary planner, drop it in the comments below. We would love to hear your favourites, no matter which state it is. Yeah. We are still massively in the planning process, so please give us yeah. your suggestions. Any tips, hints, suggestions, things that you'd love covered. Uh, look, we're so easy to contact. Just reach out to us through our website, thefeelgoodfamily.com.au. Yeah. I'm sure or you've heard it. Below, yeah, below. just let us know and we will do our best to cover it or answer any questions as well through these, these episodes. It is exciting. So It good. is so good. All right, Jasper, you ready to wrap it up? Yep. Yep, okay, you can Bye. do it. Bye. Okay, then. And there's one last thing, uh, giant apple. Okay, the giant apple. All right, so our first stop out of the Gold Coast was to head west, southwest, almost to the border, uh, out to the Southern Downs region. Mm, Great and belt, how yes, awesome. Yes, I know. Th this footage, I think, is gonna be stunning from the pictures we've seen. Uh, and the giant apple is on Jasper's list. Yeah. There you go. Well, there's lots of good giant stuff we're gonna be able to see this year, right? Yeah, that's right. <laughs> All right, we'll try and uh, collate all the giant stuff at the end of 12 months. Here we go, Jasper, let's do it. Bye. I don't like being on my own. I could use someone to hold. And I've been trying to fill the void. But my bed is getting cold. Cause I don't have you, I don't have us, at least not anymore You said you had to go away, just to figure out who you are And I'm in this empty house, with your pictures on my wall But I don't have you, I don't have us, at least not anymore
Thank you. You good, Jasper? Mm hmm. How good is this place? Do you like it? Yeah. Or do you love it? I love it most. And like it. Oh, and look, you've got some friends. Say hi, guys. Have you ever been anywhere where the birds have been so tame? Oh my goodness. Aren't that, the bird life is amazing here. <laughs> they say Australia is the home of the parrots. Mm. And this place proves that statement right. It is absolutely stunning. For our first place, I mean, we're going to do a mix of caravan parks and free camps, campsites. This isn't really a caravan park. It's more of a campsite, isn't it? Yeah, it, it feels more like a, bush, like a bush park, doesn't it? Yeah and incredibly vibrant and oh, green. Oh, so green. How oh good is all gosh. the green oh. everywhere, Jasper? It's mm. amazing. So it's called Queen Mary Falls Caravan Park yep. and Cabins. Yes. And they've got a number of cabins around. They've even got a spa cabin. No, no, I think we might have to stick our head into that later. <laughs> Do you know what? When you live in a caravan, even a bath sounds <laughs> luxurious, doesn't it? <laughs> yes, it definitely does. We have got baths. Yeah, wow. Well, yeah, Jasper's got a tub that that doubles as a toy hold and a laundry basket and everything. We're I reckon I could fit squeeze, him in it. squeeze myself yeah, in on a really hot day. <laughs> it is so beautiful here. The best part about this park is that it is straight across the road from Main Range National Park. Yeah, that's from right. School. Well, and Main Range, interestingly, I read, stretches mm. from like here in the southern downs over the uh cunningham's gap that was cool how cool was that footage that was amazing mm. um so yeah it's a pretty beautiful national park but right opposite the caravan park literally like don't take your car you walk across the road and you're at the trailhead to do the queen mary falls circuit which was two oh, k's yeah two k's easy for jasper we did not have to carry him one meter mm -hmm. which was really great oh, spectacular. Um, a good tip go clockwise yes. around yes it'll uh, save the knees a little bit it's a much easier walk back up definitely going clockwise definitely yeah. and it's a spring fed waterfall mm -hmm. so yeah. it's always flowing and it Wow, it was amazing. Amazing. And if you can get here around some of the rains, I think it would be mm. epic. So beautiful. Yeah. Yeah. Right there. Like literally right there across the yeah. road. The other thing about this park is that you can have firewood delivered to your door. Mm. We had a fire That's last so night. Nice. Wasn't that oh, good? And it's it's quite cool. I mean you are yeah. in the mountains, you know. Um and it's yeah. been quite crisp. Well, it's almost a thousand meters above sea level, not quite. I'm just shy of that. So, yeah. And they've also got an on site kiosk, so they do like gourmet foods and handmade Coffees. pies, coffee, which mm -hmm. is good. And a little uh, gift shop as well that showcases yeah. local artists. Mm. And, and yeah, from the sort of Kalani too. region. And there's a great pub we went to dinner at last night. Mm. So, check that out. All right, I think we're going to get some more planning going. What a great start, though. So good. Love it. All right. You happy, Jasper? You're eating. You're always happy if you're <laughs> eating. Okay, so here we go, Queen Mary Falls. I have to tell you, this is a two kilometer walk. They estimate it's gonna take about 40 minutes, unless you've got a four year old who's doing that. And then it's probably gonna take four hours. Leisurely walk, just a leisurely stroll, they called it. It is absolutely stunning, that one won a rainforest with these epic rock formations. 100 million year old ferns and conifers. I mean, it is a, an incredibly special place. I'm, I'm 
almost started. Yeah, only 1.98 kilometers to go. What? <laughs> Me on a treasure hunt. I long for something new. Have you heard the fairies when they sing and dance? Oh, I wish it was me. It's so wonderful. And I close my eyes. I see. How can you tell? Because it is. Yeah, okay. That's fair enough. That's a good enough reason for me. All right. Jasper, look over here. Yeah, really good. And there's green tree frogs in the background, which is good. I can hear some green tree frogs. That's true. We're getting ready for their dinner. We've got to get ready for ours, but we've got to get this fire cranking. All right. Kindling mission. Let's keep going. All right. Lead the way, explorer. <laughs> Let's find some more. Okay. Look at our campsite down there, Jasper. How good does that look? Paper bark. More paper bark. I think it will burn well. Paper bark? Yep, I think you're right. Good, no. good job. Mate, we are getting there. How much more do you reckon we should? All right, well, okay, well, let's take that. Let's take it with us and find yeah. some more. Yeah, this one. Oh, good job, mate. Good job. You got some good stuff? Yep. Oh, sure I'm... have. Excellent. Get it in there. Thanks for watching. Please do like, subscribe, and share our channel. And if you'd like more information on full-time RV travel and living, visit our website, thefeelgoodfamily.com.au. There you'll find loads of free resources, our weekly podcast, caravan cooking recipes, our monthly Go RV magazine articles, and much more. We look forward to seeing you next week. Take care of yourself and your family, and happy trails. exciting new places new experiences all right should we uh, wrap it up there <laughs> see you soon oh, well, yeah. <laughs> that's nice oh we have to do that again sorry carrot man and i've still got meds so i'm just gonna go to danger and so you could fall off a cliff if you're running and 
watch out for fun rocks. Thanks, Leda. That's the important part. That's got to hurt. Okay, that's what they're talking about when they say there's rock slides, Jasper. There's actually a person underneath that. Should we check? That's huge. Dad, you kidding? No, I just check. Is there any feet? Just have a look around the outside. It's like the Wicked Witch. Just check for some stripy Don't go that way, stockings. Though. Hmm. How are you going? You good? I can't, mm. say, can't talk, Dad. Got a mouthful of marshmallow. <laughs> <laughs>